Hello. In this video, we are going to prove the following theorem. There is no set of all sets. So to start out the proof, let's first consider an arbitrary set A. And from here, we want to show that A is not a set of all sets. So we want to find a set that is not contained in A. And the idea is we consider the following set. We consider the set of elements x and a with the property that x is not an element of x. Now, this set exists because of the axiom of specification. And this is really an axiom schema, but this is fine. So the claim is that b is not an element of a. And to see why, assume for a contradiction we instead have that b is an element of A. From here, we are going to reach a contradiction by considering two cases. Either B is an element of B, or B is not an element of B. In either case, we're going to reach a contradiction. Let's first consider the case B is an element of B. Well then, by definition of B, since B is an element of B, what that means is, if we take X to be B, then we have b is an element of a with the property that b is not an element of b. And so we have b is an element of b and b is not an element of b, but that's a contradiction. So this completes the case of b is an element of b. Now let's consider the case b is not an element of b. Well, since we're assuming b is an element of a, well, then we have B is an element of A, and B is not an element of B. But this tells us that B satisfies all the requirements to be an element of B. Because if we take X to be B, well, to say that B is an element of B means that B is an element of A with the property that B is not an element of B. But B satisfies precisely those properties, and therefore B must be an element of B. And so, again, we see B is an element of B, and B is not an element of B, which is a contradiction. And so, in either case, we reach a contradiction. Our assumption that B is an element of A led us to a contradiction, so we must instead have that B is not an element of A. And so, we have shown if A is any set, then there exists a set that is not contained in A. So A is not a set of all sets. Since A could be any set, this tells us that every set is not a set of all sets. So there is no set of all sets. And so this completes the proof. And so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video.